considering you guys were never behind until the last goal was scored. Uh, how, how do you look at that whole game? Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, I thought we played a good game. There's um, a couple lapses during the game where we definitely weren't at our best. Um, you know, in the second there, we gave up a lot of chances, but, um, you know, we did a good job sticking it, uh, sticking with it. Um, Beast made a, a few huge saves, and, um, you know, we kept it. We were up by one there, um, I don't know, two minutes left, and, um, you know, they uh, they found to get one there, and then, um, you know, I thought over time, um, you know, we had we had a couple looks too, um, but uh, yeah, no, that definitely, um, you know, you definitely want to come out on the on the other side of that one. And when you guys were on your game, what was the difference there when you were stringing shifts together and, and creating? Yeah, I think we were playing north south hockey. Um, you know, we we're we we're hounds on pucks. Um, you know, just high energy, high pace, and um, you know that's when we're at our best. It's no secret. Um, we have a lot of skilled players in this room, and um, when we're going north south and um, you know playing with high energy, that's that's when we're at our best. How'd your goal develop? Um, yeah, I guess uh, a rim happened. Um, EJ just kind of called me. He's like, "Go for it, go for it." So I, I um, went, rimmed it back to Oli, and um, you know Oli made a, an incredible slip pass there to me, and um, you know I just found a way to, to put him in the back of the net. Is that all instinct there when you're going between the legs like that? Or? Yeah, honestly, um, you know, I'm just trying to do the the move that I think is going to work, and um, you know, kind of just let my instincts take over. Did you guys maybe need to be more offensive in the third period? I mean, I think I said to Dylan, it was five six minutes in the period, neither team had a shot, which means you were defending okay, but you also weren't coming forward either. Do you think you need to be a little bit more? offensive too in those types of situations? Yeah, I mean, I think we just got to stick to our game and play full 60. Uh, you know, the best, your best defense is offense. So uh, if the puck's in the O-zone, uh, you know, it's unlikely that's going to go in the back of your net. So um, it's definitely no secret. You definitely want to play in the O-zone. But, uh, you know, if it's if it's a scrambling game, like um, the third kind of was, it was a neutral zone game, um, you know, you kind of just got to shut it down and uh, clog up the middle. Uh, what do you think about what you're able to show in these nine games to – to make them, you know, make a decision here. Yeah, honestly, uh, you know, I'm just trying to be consistent and play my game every game. Uh, help this team win hockey games. Um, you know, that's that's really my my mindset is, you know, whatever I can do to help this team win. Um, that was that was really kind of the thinking process for my on my behalf. Have you scored many between the legs goals? Um, not in a while. Uh, I like to try them in practice. You know, I stay out there. 30 minutes after practice, you know, working on those kind of things, that in Michigan, kind of all those moves.